We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome back to the Freak Show, where... Our one rule is, we are the Goblin Bane. I am your host today, Bumpy McSquiggums. A quest that became legend continues now. Oh no, it's some deadly rats. Whatever will we do? We shall slay them is what we will sh is what we is shall will be doing. What? Oh, there's a third one over there. Yeah. Cool, 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 cool. Come on, bring it on. <laughs> oh. Alright, you're within range of me. I don't like that. Alright, I'm gonna cook you. I'm gonna blast you in the face. I'm gonna chop you, and then I'm guns to back up. We utilizing that range like a boss. Alright. Hmm. Oh, boo. It's boo. <laughs> Bring it on. Ah, I was kidding. Why did you hit me? Ah. <laughs> bye bye. Ooh, a plate gorget. That's plus one. To what I currently have. Uh, or a gorge. It is 11. Uh, Wait, stop moaning. You're fine. You do this all the time. It's okay. Uh, wow. What's going on? Ooh, there's uh, something spooky up there. Oh, here, here are the stairs that lead up to the, I'm going to assume the graveyard, which I almost assuredly do not want to go up to, but I have to. My wanderlust brings me to this place. Oh, I'm so scared. Oh, God. Okay. This seems lovely. Like nothing bad could ever happen. I'm definitely not going to walk into that yet. Maybe in, maybe in, later. Maybe in, maybe in a little bit. Okay. Well, we got some exploring to do. Oh, what did I upset? Wow, they are they have some incredible eyesight. Oh, oh no. Uh oh. This got real scary real quick. Did I hit you? Okay. I mean, I'm pretty sure I survived if I survived the wolf. <laughs> Holy heck. I don't know that that was a good idea, I'll be honest. It's fine, probably. Alright, let's get this, uh... Focus on me. Bring it on. Oh, he didn't go down. Oh boy. Oh, this is not looking great. Really? They're too far. They're too far away. Alright, well. scared now. Wait, why didn't he go? Okay. Everything's probably fine. One would have to assume... Yeah, I know. 
All right. Bring it on. We have at least a little bit of... Man, there's so many of them, though. So at least we have a little bit of a, a spacing uh, situation going on here. So we can do at least a little bit of damage before it rolls out on us. Okay. Got him with that. This guy's gonna roll up and... Oh, he's just, just short. Oh, they're both just short. Should hurt him. Okay. We're doing it. Sort of. But we're very fatigued, which is not great. Thank goodness there's no zombies behind me. She doesn't have enough. All right. That is fair. Okay, he's poisoned, so that's going to be ticking down on him. All right. I think we still get hit here. Yep, we do. All right. We're not regening any magic. Oh, are you serious? No. You can't miss, buddy. That's a disaster. Well, he's attacking other people now, at least. Oh, that's very weak compared to what we had. Oh, they're just outside the range. I think this guy just goes down here. Okay. We can do this. This is an epic battle. But I think it's an epic battle we can potentially win with maybe zero losses. Okay, he's lobbing stuff at us now. We're definitely fatigued. I think we gotta close with them. She doesn't have enough for this, right? No. Tell us how much. Oh, it shows us what we have. Okay. 39. How much does this one cost? 50 mana. Okay, makes sense. Oh, we missed again. Gosh darn it. Okay, he died. Dang it! Our barbarian gets a little bit weak as he, uh. Well, our warrior gets a little bit, uh. inaccurate, shaky, I don't, I don't know what to call it, uh, as he gets tired. Oh, he's still alive. Okay, we're, we're okay. We got this. Right here, this is the end. 
Boom, baby. What? We had to have leveled up off of that, right? No? Really? Oh, we're... Oh. We're so close. Oh, that's that's depressing. That's all right. Okay. A uh, lot of lot of stuff to loot. All right. I think you're the furthest out. One. Another goblin. Oh wait, hold on. Can we do this. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay. There's three goblins there. One up here. Oh, nice. Well, I'll tell you what, our, our light and medium armor people having a field day. Oh, we got a plate gauntlet. What? Some more thick leather pants. All right. Oh, well, that was intense. That was just so much stuff going on. All right, let's start with the... Uh, a plate gauntlet. Absolutely going to put that on. Bam. That puts our armor class relatively high. I'll have to assume. We'll, we'll take a look later. A pair of old leather pants. That's medium armor. What's going on you? Uh, light armor gloves. That's... This is our garbage uh, column, we'll say. Maybe a better shield and medium armor... Armor. 14 and 14. Or just a different look. Yeah, that's, that's fine. I mean, I could still put that somewhere. Alright, so. Uh, let's take a peek at us. This is light armor. Um... So put the light armor on you. This is a eight to uh, eight armor and three defense. This is ten armor and two defense. Interesting. I think I'm still gonna put this over here. I don't know if the three defense is better. If the eight armor is better, to be honest. Or the, I think I think the two the plus two armor negates more than the plus one defense. But I could be completely wrong. Uh, that that's wild speculation at this point. <sighs> okay. Well, we survived a pretty epic battle. There were two wolves and five or six goblins. That was a lot. So they said that there was supposed to be a cave. Oh my god. Okay, well, I, this is what we're doing now, I guess. Anyhow, they had said that there was a cave behind the stairs near the south cave. Or north cave, or whatever cave. There was a cave involved. He's still standing, huh? I think the poison's gonna actually be our biggest problem. Oh, they're real close. He should have died, really? Oh, no. Uh, dang, I didn't save either. Well, that's not good. time there. We kill you. I should have shot this guy. I don't know what I was thinking. Uh-huh. Yep. This, this is going well.
Okay. Bring it on, I guess. Okay. It's much less devastating. Oh, they did group up for this. Oh my god. Oh no. All right, um... I... I've lost track of who I've weakened. Well, here's hoping. I killed two, I leveled up. On... Okay, on her. She got full magic back from that. Okay, I avoided at least one hit there. Oh, there's still so many, though. Oh, this is bad. Is it, is it my turn to swing? Okay, okay. Oh, thank goodness. There's still so many. down. I, I think that's it for us. There's so many rats. How are there this many rats? Oh, uh, well that's unfortunate. Dang. Lucky there. Alright, let's just see what happens. I mean, there's, there's a chance that we can do something here. A very small chance. No, she died of the poison. I couldn't heal. Leave me alone. I'm scared. <laughs> well, we'll be right back. Okay, we're back. And I redid the fight. And... Well, well, I mean, I redid the fight with the goblins and the wolves, and it went well. I think I had to use one more potion than I did before, and we got, like, less than half the loot, which is just the worst. Um, that does show us that loot is randomized, which I do appreciate, but yeah, we got, like, garbage loot, like, just so bad. We had boots and gloves, we had extra armor for our boy, I mean... Oh, we got almost nothing. We uh, what, what did we get? I got uh, an extra piece of armor for her. She's got eight armor on our armor class. That that is what I acquired from uh, that, which is uh, disappointing. But such is life. I mean, I could complain about it. I did a little bit there. There's, there's a little winage. There's a large group of bad guys here too. Okay. Dang it. All right, well, my, my hope was to actually get a free shot off before bad Juju Magumbo went down, but. What is, how close do I have to be? What is the range on this skill?
That was the opposite of what I wanted to do. All right, I have no idea how bad this is going to go. Probably fairly bad. We already have a ranged guy within range. No, just the wolf didn't actually hit us. Yet. Don't worry, there's still time. Yeah, not great. Ugh. Brutal. This is less overall stuff, but a much worse start for us here. Alright, here's open. Oh, they missed. Dang it, that wasn't enough to take it down, huh? Still alive, too. Alright, see what's next. He's just short of being able to hit us. Okay, Wolf died. Hi. Figured that was kind of how that was going to play out. He should be really close to death. I'm going to have to draw aggro. This should kill him. Alright, we got the double level up there. So that helps us actually tremendously with our survival tactics here. All right, little Gabo friend. Just swing on him. Were they close enough? No. Well, let's hit him. Down he goes. It's that's all four of our folks leveled up. So kind of perfect timing, really. I, I am assuming we could probably level up mid-combat, but I'm not positive. So I think that's fine. We are a bit fatwagged. He should die right here. Oh, he's running. He died. All right, that, that's fair. He's dead now. There it is. Sweet, sweet treasure loot to be had. Hopefully we make up for our lack of good loot in the last one. I would suggest um, probably quick saving after every battle. I've even considered, and I, I don't know, I still might do it, but I don't think I'm going to because it doesn't feel good. Um, maybe running back through and doing that fight and this fight again off camera. To try to get better loot, but I think I'm just gonna live with it. I'm gonna save over the auto save and go from there, or the the, the quick save rather. There we go. All right, let's uh, let's see what we got, and then let's um, let's do our levels. All right, so this shield is decidedly worse than the one that we have. Uh, light armor boots. Well, again, since you're the the beefcake of the hour, I guess you're gonna to go that route. You already have pants. So, like, there's very little reason to put much on her. If we could just put it on him instead. These are medium armor boots. Okay. Because she doesn't have the armor rating, or the armor class proficiency, and neither does he. But he's the one that can taunt and tank in front line. So it makes more sense to put it on him. Ooh. This is a two-handed beast. I think what we have is better. And this is a one-handed beast, which is not quite as good as what we have. Six to eight, yeah. I think what we have is better. Yeah, with the plus two to attack power, even though it's minus one on the damage, right? The chip longsword has one more damage. Two less attack power, but this is also 
This is also an axe, so I am getting, I think, the double benefit here. Which is cool. Alright, so I will throw this stuff up here. And I guess we go and we do this now. Uh, this is level 3, so we don't get any talent points that we have to use. That tracks. Two to dexterity, one to speed, one and one. I don't, again, I don't know that I need strength, but it's there. Uh, two, one, one. Okay, and then I think with her, I'm going to do it differently. I'm going to go two, one, one, and one. Get a little bit more wisdom. All right, we have no resistances with her. Next speed boost is fine. The initiative is 11, 10, 15, and 11. Uh, we have one action point, six movement, six movement, six movement, six movement. I didn't change. Combat energy is seven, six, four, and four. Combat energy goes up with constitution? Yeah. Okay, and spell damage. Do we have any, uh, like, mana res restorative stuff in combat? Oh, that's interesting. Melee damage and range damage. They have a different pop-up than all the others now, so that was, I believe, added. And it shows normal damage and then all the magic damage plus piercing damage. Very cool breakdown. Or maybe this has always been here. I, I don't know. It just it's not red like everything else, so. Oh. I again I don't know. Is there any mana restoration in combat itself? I feel like there was with the uh with the talent stuff, right? This is extra mana on level ups. This is plus 100 mana. And then that's buffs. Okay. Regenerate mana every round. Passive. Okay. 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 Cool. I, I'm, going, I'm going a little longer. I, it's so scary though, man. You don't, you don't know what's out here. There's a wolf over there. What else is out there? You don't know what you're aggroing. You could be aggroing like a thousand things at once. I'm gonna do another quick save here. Like it's it's actually I think that it's a rat. Oh, forget it. All right, what did I what did I upset? Oh, do, do I have initiative? Woo! We made a critical hit. Good job, Splooch. All right, I say that we cast on you. throw stuff at you. Yeah, I like it. Big hit, and there it is. Nice easy battle for a change. Very good. Okay, so, from what I've gathered... The other thing that the guy was talking about in the, the journal. South of the village, right on the foot of the cliff behind the stairs that led to the graveyard. Foot of the cliff behind the stairs that led to the graveyard. Now, if we look at the map. 
This is south of the village. There's the East Crypt. There's a South Cave over here. But this whole thing is just filled with all those rats. And as it stands right now, I don't think that we are powerful enough to, to deal with the rat, the rat kingdom here. Okay, well, we're going to walk into the shadowy lands over here, and we're going to see what other miscreants that we may have actually missed. I think we probably got all the battles out of this area, but just in case not, we're going to run through. Oh, I said something. Oh, how did I miss a giant horde of uh, these dudes? All right. Well... Feels like they should be within range. I understand that they're not, but it feels like they should be. Alright. Quick shot to you. More poison to you. One more shot to you. And then a poison on you. And then we back up. Okay, we got one ranged guy lobbing stuff at us. I think we're okay. He's dead? Yeah. Big hit there. Oh, I hit him. I was aiming for the guy behind. That's okay. I, I could have... Maybe I couldn't have angled better. I don't know. I, I'm not particularly worried about it. I think we're okay. Very nice. Big hit on you. Okay, he did. I only imagine you're not going to make it... Too much longer. Should I should have hit him with this? That's all right. He's dead. All right. Okay. What was that? Ooh, everyday wear. I mean, it's terrible, but it exists. All right, let's see. This is an antidote. Oh, health regeneration. Ooh, very nice. Uh, heals 180 hit points over three rounds. So assuming it works the way you would think, that's basically 60 hit points per round. I think that's totally fine. Yes, I can do basic beginner's traditional uh, math. It's, it's fine. All right, all this stuff we're going to sell. Let's look at the map. Let's just walk around here real quick. Nothing seems to really be happening. Oh yeah, we've kind of explored this area. I say I head back to town and uh, we'll do some selling and stuff in town. And then we'll head out and we'll uh, continue our adventure in the next episode. Yep. It's that time again, guys and gals. Anyway, folks, uh, still having fun. I got to remember to quick save more often because, again, this game's super deadly. Uh, you can wander into just death. And at this stage, it doesn't look like there's any way to flee from combat. I don't know if that's something that's going to improve down the line that we'll be able to flee from combat, or maybe not. Maybe we never will. I don't know. But it would be nice to be like, oh, I've made a terrible mistake, and then be able to back out if you're within so much range. And maybe there is a way to do that, and I just don't know. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to dig around, do some stuff, uh, some look it up, some stuff here inside the game, and see if I can't get a better understanding of certain things. And, I mean, I, I understand most of it. Like, I think this is all very well put together at this point. But I just want to glean a little bit of extra info. I want to see if there's any additional buttons I need to be aware of in the control scheme. And uh, I want to look through some more of the, the like the stats and stuff to see if there's anything else I can glean from there. Anyway, folks, that's it for now. Till the very next episode, I've been your host, 
Bumpy McSquiggums, thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer.